Hello, today we are going to work on lesson 22 and it's second grade worksheet. So we're going to first solve the story problems. So this first part is going to be a review from last week's. And let's look at the example again. So in the example it says, There are 27 children playing kickball on the playground. Then 13 children joined the game. How many children in all are playing kickball? So... You have to use this way, this method, in order to solve this problem. So, for example, there is this is there is twenty seven and thirteen, and we have to know, uh, the sum of those two. So, if we add seven and three, we get ten, right? But we can only put uh, the ones place on this side. So, if we have ten. Then zero is going to be on the ones place, right? So we can't put one over here. We have to put one on the top because uh, when we have 10, one is on the uh, tens side, not the ones uh, section, right? So one has to go on the top. So now we have to add one plus two plus one. So we get four. So the answer is 40 children. Okay, and how do we check? So we know that 27 is close to 30, and 13 is close to 10. So 30 plus 10 is 40. So we know that our answer makes sense because it's either the same or it's either similar when we use this method, rounding method. So if it's similar, at least, then we know that our answer makes sense and so let's try it we have to add through regrouping so regrouping means when we have 10 after adding 7 and 3 since 1 is on the tens place we have to put 1 over here that's regrouping right okay so it says there are 35 girls and 24 boys in the play how many children are in the play so we have to use this regrouping method. So this is one's place and this is going to be the tens place. So let's see, it said 35 girls, 35. You have to put three on the tens, uh, tens place and five on the ones place, right? And then 24. Okay, let's see what we get, and then we have to add. So 5 plus 4 is 9, so there is nothing to regroup because there is no more than 10 ones, right? And then 3 plus 2 is 5. So we have 59 children, so 59 children is the answer for number 1. And then... Let's move on to the next page. Then now let's look at number four. So for number four, it says 28 girls and 19 boys are on the playground. How many children are on the playground? So let's do it again. This is one's place. This is going to be the tens place. It was 28 and 19. 28, 19, right? So now this is different from our first question because there is more than 10 ones. So if you add 8 and 9, what do we get? 17, right? 17 is more than uh, 10 ones, which means we have to regroup it now. So it's larger than 9. So we have to regroup it. 17 but we can't write one over here also because uh when we have 17 one is supposed to be on the tens place so we have to put one over here and then now we have to add it so one plus two is three and three plus one is four so the answer is going to be 47 children Okay, then let's move on to the next page. And it says two-digit addition by regrouping. So it's similar as this one. Yeah. 
but we have to answer these questions first. So let's look at the example. So it says 25 plus 16. Then it says add the ones. Are there 10 or more ones? If so, regroup 10 ones as 110. So it's basically the same thing as what we did last time, but it's in the chart. So when we add 25 and 16, which which ones are on the ones place? 5 and 6, right? So when we add the ones that are on the ones place, 5 and 6, is are there 10 or more ones? Yes, there are 10 or more ones because when we add 5 and 6, it's 11, right? So we would have to put one over here, another one over here, which means we have 10 or more ones. So we have to circle yes. So it's larger than 9 when we add the numbers that are on the 1's place when it's larger than 9. Number is larger than 9. Then we have to regroup it. So we would have to say yes. So since we said yes, we have to regroup it again. Uh, which means we have to add them like the ones that we did on the previous page. So let's add it. So 11... And then four. So we have forty one. When we have, since we have forty one, four is on the tens place and one is on the ones place. So we have to write four tens and one ones. Okay, then uh let's look at number four. So number four we have twenty six and thirty nine. So twenty six and thirty nine. Like it says, uh, after adding the ones, we have to find if there's 10 or more ones, right? Which means larger than 9. So 26 and 39. When we add them, um, sorry, is it larger than 9? When we add the ones? Uh, so 6 plus 9 is 15. So it is larger than it is 10 or more ones. So we have to put one over here. And then when we add 1 plus 2 is 3. And 3 plus 3 is 6. So we have to first say yes. Because it is larger than 9. When we add the numbers on the ones place. So yes. And then we got 65. So 6 is on the tens place. And 5 is on the 1's place. So 6 tens and 5 ones is the answer for number 4. Like your rest of them, you can try. Thank you.